Cynthia Calvillo took advantage of a big opportunity presented to her on Saturday when she defeated former title challenger Jessica I by unanimous decision in the UFC on ESPN TED headliner. This fight was Calvillo's debut in the UFC women's flyweight division after fighting her previous bouts at 115 pounds, but also having some struggles making that weight ultimately forces her up and she gets the number one ranked, according to the UFC's rankings, fighter in the division, the number one contender, and goes in there and pulls off a successful performance, in my mind, winning pretty much every round in there against I. She was able to score some key takedowns, land some key strikes, and get the win. And now she is set up for some great opportunities in this new weight class for her. As I said earlier, I ranked number one, according to the UFC's rankings, coming into this fight. And now that leapfrogs Calvillo, probably not into that top spot, but some somewhere very close and she is going to get a big fight for sure and right after the win another former title challenger in Caitlin Chukagian calls her out for a matchup in the future Calvillo was not dismissive of it when asked about that matchup afterwards she said she is looking to get back in there quite soon Chukagian saying the same after her recent win over Antonia Shevchenko the fight makes all the sense as long as they can line it up and everyone is healthy and ready to go Calvillo did say she needs to be cleared by a doctor after getting an MRI but feels she will be able to get back in there pretty quickly what she wants to do what Chukagian wants to do fight makes all the sense in the world book it after UFC on ESPN 10.